Georgia, Mr. Scott, for one minute. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. My goal is to return city to profitability as soon as possible, and I've told my board of directors that my salary should be $1 per year with no bonus until we return to profitability. We believe this is the right approach for the consumer and for the stability of our financial system as a whole. My goal is to make this a profitable investment for the American people as soon as possible. The best way for us to make this happen is to return our company to profitability. When I became CEO a little bit more than a year ago, I demanded accountability. I removed the people responsible for city's financial distress. I formed a new management team. I restructured the company. Gentlemen, you heard the question. If I could make the request, perhaps individually. I would also like to say something about the airplane that was in the news. We did not adjust quickly enough to this new world. And I take personal responsibility for that mistake. In the end, I canceled delivery. We need to do a better job of acknowledging and embracing the new realities. Let me be clear with the committee. I get the new reality, and I will make sure City gets it as well. Mr. Chairman, Ranking Member Baucus, members of the committee, I appreciate the opportunity to speak to you today about our role in the TARP program. We would urge you to restore confidence in our industry and the markets. The events of the past months have shaken the foundation of our global financial system. And they've made clear the need for profound changes to that system. At Morgan Stanley, we've dramatically brought down leverage, increased transparency, reduced our level of risk, and made changes to how people are paid. We increased the total debt raised for clients. I believe that both our firm, our industry, have far to, to go to regain the trust of taxpayers, investors, and public officials. As a recipient of an investment from the U.S. government, we recognize our serious responsibilities to the American people. To the consumers, to your credit card holders, indicated